Olá, meu nome é Ricardo Figueiredo, do Federal University of Minas Gerais, Brasil. The name of the work I'm going to present is developing one part of polymers using nitron water chains from Brazil. It has an introduction, experimental procedures, results in discussion, conclusions, and references. The mining industry is related to economic development in many countries, but also responsible for generating large amounts of wastes that can be very harmful, as we can see and remember from 2015 to 2019 here in Brazil. The word geopolymer, geopolymer comes from the Greek, where geo is related to natural resources, all many and various parts. So it's an uh, inorganic polymer that can be used in many ordinary Portland cement, cement applications. And they have some advantages like the use of waste as precursor materials and the capacity to incorporate fine aggregates. The main of this work is verify the appropriate amount of tailing that could be added to geopolymer paste without loss of mechanical resistance. So we have as perk, so we have metacoline. As activators, we have sodium silicate and sodium hydroxide, and iron ore tails are used as fine aggregates. We also added some water to make one part of polymers. So here we have the chemical compositions, and here the mixed proportions. We use it for in this work 50, 55, and 60 percent of IoT with the water to bind ratio kept at 0 0.38, and here the molar ratios. We also assessed compressive strength at 1, 3, 7, and 14 days. As a result, we have particle size distribution. The metacaulin present a mean particle size of 35 micrometers, while the IoT present a mean particle size of 74 micrometers. Um, we have also the mineral semi quantitative analysis of metacaulin, and we can see that. Metacaulin is mostly amorphous with some few uh, crystalline phases like kaolin, muscovite, and quartz. The compressive strength showed, showed that the IoT 60, with 60% 60 of IoT, uh, present the highest values for, for compressive strength. Uh, it's around 47 MPa, while IoT 1555 present uh, around 40 MPa and didn't show a significant difference among them. So the increase in IoT amount resulted in the in increasing compressive strength, with, which might be associated with a good packing of particles. So the increase in the quantity of tailings in mortars promoted an increase in the compressive strength, suggesting that the design phase synthesizer is possibly able to incorporate larger quantities of fine aggregates than the ones tested in this work. Here are the references, and thank you.